Hi, I'm Pat Higarty, Principal Counsel at Higarty Law. I'm here with my friend and colleague Jill Taylor, and we're working together on the RCMP class action. I'm Jill Taylor. I was a nurse for 14 years before I went into law. We were both appointed as Justice of the Peace at the Calgary Court Centre. So we presided in bail court together, and we presided in traffic court together, and we debated, and we got to know each other, and um, we're working together again. It's great. It, it's been a terrific opportunity for us to recruit uh, Jill to, to work with us on this project. She has a lot of leadership qualities and experience. And I'm excited to be here, and that you uh, respect my ideas about bringing in the health care and the um, special process that we've developed that's going to make sure that these ladies are not harmed again by telling us their experience. I've been practicing law for many, many years. I've dealt with many, many claims, many types of class actions. And I must say, this particular one is the most uh, significant uh, in terms of the effect on our country uh, that I've ever, I've ever had the honor and privilege to, to be involved with before. One of the things we do and we're committed to is exercise empathy for our clients. We try as best we can to put ourselves in, in the client's position. And in this particular case, what a harrowing experience it must have been for people to be taken advantage of in this fashion in a workplace environment where, where they were probably feeling pretty powerless. And we, we try to approach the, uh, the, the, uh, each claim in a holistic fashion where we look at the totality of the situation and the uniqueness of each individual. And we try to lend support as best we can for that particular individual's needs. So we are using a trauma-informed care approach. Trauma-informed care is a method that we use mostly in healthcare. So I've developed a process with Pat and our other team members here where we're going to ensure that every claimant who comes to us is assigned a primary claims advocate. That person has a background primarily in social work, although we do have some other people with uh, nursing backgrounds. And they will be the ones to walk through the story and the experience with the claimant. Those specialists will work with the claimant throughout the process for as long as the claimant needs to the conclusion. And with any lawsuit, uh, there's a ton of paper that's needed by the court. We don't expect our clients to do that. We will do that for them with the help of our paralegals and our expertise. And we can promise you the highest degree of discretion and respect for your privacy. It's one of the things that we're very committed to from our experience is the need for systems to be very, very methodical, uh, very particular in gathering the information, separating what's relevant, uh, what's relevant from what may not be as relevant, uh, and, and presenting each claim, each claim in the most optimum way that can be justified. In, with a view to, number one, ensuring qualification to receive compensation, and number two, to endeavoring to optimize the highest level of compensation that, mm -hmm. can, be, that can be achieved. So to go to the thoroughness that we require to submit to the court in this, we do need a lot of information. So it's great that Pat's got the ability to make sure that information is formalized. What I bring to the table is how we help you tell us about that information. But one thing, uh, I recognize that I'm a male and I, I don't think that the claimants are gonna feel comfortable sharing their experiences with me, so I will not be doing the interviews on this. I'm gonna leave this to qualified professionals other than myself who happen to be female. And we have developed an all women team, which includes psychologists and the nurses, social workers that I mentioned before. So if you think you're qualified, we encourage you to go to our website and register.